Giggsy, back in February, you actually did save someone's life. Tell us briefly about that. Yeah, um, quite emotional thinking about it, but uh, a gentleman collapsed at the venue, um, at the gym, uh, cardiac arrest, and um, long and short, I had to apply CPR, defibrillation, and uh, luckily we, um, we got him back and uh, got him on air ambulance and he made a full recovery. So yeah, that was back in February. Um, and it was great to see him back at our awards night. So uh, yeah, very good, yeah. Well, they talk about lightning strikes twice. Maybe not quite as dramatic this time. We're at Birmingham Airport now. We've just landed from Portugal. Something happened on the flight. Yes, a um, bit of commotion on the flight. Obviously, um, people were at work quite aware. I'm, I'm not really the best of flyers, but um, a lady had collapsed uh, in the aisle of the flight, one of the other passengers. Um, fainted, collapsed, banged her head and was semi-conscious. So um, I thought, obviously, being qualified as I am, it was my duty to go, go take over. And thankfully, she's OK and she's got off the plane now and all worked out well in the end. Yeah, so it seems to be, I seem to be in the right place at the right time at the moment. Well, I heard the commotion, the lady obviously fell over. You were up out of your seat very quickly. I guess that's a natural instinct. Very natural, yes. Um, even just, you know, there may be someone of, you know, further qualified, a doctor or even paramedic or someone there. But, you know, as a, as a trained person, it's your duty to go and see if you can help at least, whoever it is, you know, wherever you are. So, yeah, luckily I was on board and it took an hour off my time and it, my thought wasn't on flying at the time anyway which was good so the flight went nice and quickly and I was less nervous.